What's good, her rich fam, her rich credit tapping in. Let's get straight into it. So look, y'all, today is a very completely different video. Like, I don't know, man. Normally I talk on this channel about some credit sauce, but today I'm just acknowledging that I just hit 100K on YouTube. And how do I feel about it? If I'm being honest with y'all, I'm not feeling like fulfilled i don't know how to explain it to you guys i know i've reached you know a good milestone and a lot of people might look at this shit and be like oh my god he just hit 100k but to be honest i feel like it's just a regular day to me if i'm being completely to the core honest with y'all i know a lot of you guys look at it as like oh my god he should be excited happy right now jumping up in the air but to be honest man this shit is like another day i feel like i still got more shit to accomplish like i gotta keep going like i told you guys in my past videos i i've already disciplined myself this is part of my lifestyle so i just look at this shit like another day if that makes sense like i don't know man it's, it's just a honey k to me if i'm being honest with y'all i'm not disregarding you guys man that follow me you know i got 100k subscribers i got 100k people that watch me 100k people that tap in with me that trust my knowledge all type of shit right i got people nowadays that recognize me when i go walk in the streets and say yo hood rich bro you changed my life that shit makes me feel good i'm not disregarding that i'm just saying like it just feels normal to me like i, I still got more shit to accomplish you get what i'm saying i feel like probably because i look at the bigger picture you get what i'm saying i hit 100k okay other people might see that as oh my god but to me it's like damn i just hit 100k all right let's keep working you know let's keep grinding fuck it it's not the end you know we got to keep working but yeah man i hit 100k i'm very thankful though trust me i'm very thankful this shit happened fast though man this shit happened fast probably like what was it five months ago six seven months ago we was at something like a thousand subscribers we was at a thousand subscribers and then one day i was like you know what fuck it let me start posting on youtube let me drop the sauce on youtube because i feel like these people on these youtube platforms when it comes to credit sauce they really not dropping the sauce like how they supposed to they missing out a lot of you know loopholes they missing out a lot of information that they not really explaining to you guys so i was like let me just fill in that hole and add my own sauce to it because as you guys know the reason why i stand out a lot is because i don't try to put up a certain persona when it comes to this credit shit like other people have told me in the past, yo, hood rich, you should, you should like change it up. You should wear a suit and tie. You should talk differently. Like try to talk more professional, yada, yada, yada. But I feel like people gravitate towards me because I keep a thousand, I keep it a stack and I don't change up the way I move. You get what I'm saying? Just for a YouTube video, I don't come on this channel and put up a suit and tie. That's why I feel like people gravitate towards me in a short amount of time. So obviously the shit that I'm doing is working. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah, man, we hit 100K. I greatly, 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 greatly appreciate all you guys that reached out to me that, you know, asked me for credit sauce because you guys, that shows me that y'all trust my knowledge. Y'all fuck with me. And like I said, I got people recognizing me in public, which is different, man. Like the lifestyle that I come from, you know, my background is not the best lifestyle. You know, I don't complain, though. Everything happens for a reason. God put me in this position to suffer it and make something out of it. So I love how I was raised. And another reason why a lot of people gravitate towards me is because you guys can relate to the situation that I was in. You guys are probably currently in that situation and trying to get out of it from just watching my videos. That's why a lot of fucking people gravitate towards me i went through the section eight housing i went through the mattress on the floor i went through job after job i was working in sun jobs i went through landscaping jobs i went through construction jobs i put the images right here i was already born a millionaire i just gotta go get that mill i ain't tripping man i ain't tripping about this weak ass job with this weak ass pay because i know what i'm gonna become no fucking ride at all i'm walking home and i'm recording this shit because i'm gonna go back to these these type of videos that I'll be recording because I know I'm going to be successful. I know I'm going to be great. Mind of abundance. Mind of power. Out of work. Fuck it though, man. The struggle that I went through. I went through all this shit. I manifested this lifestyle and it came to me because I believed in myself and a lot of people don't believe. Oh, yeah, I got a call that interrupted the video, but let me end it off here. There's a final thing that I'm going to say. My mom doubted me, my sisters doubted me, my whole family doubted me, my whole city doubted me, my whole circle doubted me, everybody fucking doubted me, but I made some shit work. I turned over my life and my lifestyle because I wouldn't accept my shit reality. 
I was a very arrogant person. You know, nobody could tell me different about the path that I was going to take. People would try to put their shit expectations on me. No, you know, you're not going to try to change my mind. I know what the fuck is going to turn out for me. I know what's going to work for me. And look how shit is playing out right now. So if I can do it, you can do it. I'm telling you guys, if I can do it, you can do it. Don't overthink this shit, man. You know, you only have one life to live. You could turn your life around in a matter of a year or less. I'm telling you, I just put in the fucking work. Stop being lazy. Make some shit work. Cut off bad habits. Cut off bad people that are not adding value to your life. Do it. You have to do it. If you want to reach this level, you have to. And I'm not where I want to be at right now in life. You know, I got a whole fucking, a, a whole path ahead of me that I got to accomplish. I'm a youngin', but I'm making some shit work. I'm grinding every day and I want you guys to do the same. But we're going to end it off here. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this video. I appreciate y'all very much. 100k people. We're going to turn up, man. We're going to turn up. We're going to keep posting. I'm going to keep dropping some sauce for y'all. I'm going to keep adding some value. Damn. 100k. Now that shit's starting to hit me. Goddamn 100k. Yo, man. I, I wasn't feeling like this when I woke up in the morning. But 100k. God damn. All right. That's it for today, man. Y'all have a good day to hurry, Rich Way. Come.